Hello everybody. I grew up with Rocky. I grew up with seeing Sylvester Stallone in this character, and I eventually got around to seeing Rocky IV, which has Rocky going against Ivan Drago, and Creed II, which is in theaters right now, covers the son of Apollo Creed facing the son of Ivan Drago. If you have not seen the Rocky series, there's of course going to be spoilers in here. Apollo Creed, of course, in the original Rocky series, passes away, and Ivan Drago is the one that kills him in the ring, because he is, hits him too hard, I always supposed. And this film is fine. It covers the, the journey of Adonis Creed, the son of Apollo Creed, facing the son of Ivan Drago. There's, of course, the chemistry here between Rocky Balboa and Adonis Creed. Their relationship is one of the most likable things about this movie, as well as in the first Creed film. It had a similar feeling to that. I enjoyed Creed, but I wasn't overwhelmed by it. I enjoyed Rocky, the first movie. I liked Rocky too, maybe even a little bit more, and the films progressively started to get a little bit worse after that. But apart from that, I enjoy the original Rocky series. The Creed films... They're okay. This film, it gives a lot of depth to Adonis Creed's character, and there's a lot of guilt here from uh, feeling that, you know, Adonis wants revenge against what the Drago family did to his dad, and that his dad was never able to raise him properly because, of course, he passed away in the ring. There's a lot of depth given to the Drago family as well. The son of Ivan Drago being a bit of a bully because you learn that um, he's being treated poorly by his father and it passes on. So there's, there's a bit of that dynamic here as well. I enjoyed this film. It wasn't overwhelming. It didn't have a lot in it that I went, that's awesome. But it had a good story. Sylvester Stallone, of course, in his title character of Rocky, Always very good to see. There's lots of motivational speeches in here. There's a lot of messages in here about rising up to a task and facing up to things when you don't necessarily want to, which is a message that really needs to resonate in the current world as it stands. I appreciated this movie. I admired the direction that it took and I enjoyed it. It gets a 7 out of 10 from me. Do go see it, but I do hope that this is the last Rocky film. It had a good story. It had a good fight sequence. Everything in here felt like it was done the best that it could be. If there's another Rocky film, I really don't see it adding anything to the franchise. I hope it ends here, but of course, if there's another one, I'll see it. Thank you so much, as always, for watching, everybody. I'm on a new set again. I haven't been very active recently. I do apologize for that, but I have joined Twitter recently. If you want to see more thoughts on movies and films that I haven't reviewed on this channel yet, or if you want to interact with me further, you can find my Twitter link in the About section of my channel, or you can just go on Twitter and find me. It's the same name as my YouTube channel itself. You can also visit me on my website. You can also interact with me on my Patreon page. You can get involved with me on there if you feel to. Thank you so much, everyone, as always, for watching. Do look forward to more reviews coming very soon. I appreciate you all. You matter, and I will see you in my next review. As always, take care.